Hi everyone, welcome to the second part of the six part series of Little Boats from Johanna Basford's Small Victories um, book coloured with polychromos pencils. Now I had a few minutes um, since finishing the last video and a bit of a ponder and decided that I would like to continue with the rainbow colours that were used for the first boat. So I'm hoping that everyone is happy with that but of course you don't have to do it the same way as me. I just thought it might be a bit of fun and a little bit different. So we're coming in close to our second one and I'm going to start with our water. Now we use the um, um, light cobalt turquoise and I'm going to do it the same way. So we'll just make a start with that. I've kept all the pencils out. This is a bit awkward. Um, to uh, I really would um, normally turn my book around to do this. Um, yeah, I kept all the pencils out from last time, so we'll probably be using the same ones. Um, I'm not sure if we'll use all the browns that we used last time, we may do, um, but we'll use all the rainbow colours the same way. Let's just fade that down a little bit and then we can leave that bit. Um, where should I put that pencil? There we go, just out of the way. Okay. So I thought I would decide, do the windows first and we'd do them the same way we did over here. So we sort of used an extra colour, didn't we, that wasn't in our rainbow. The um, dark cadmium yellow for the sorts of outsides. So we're going to do that again, just around the edge. I just think it gives it a bit more of a warm, friendly glow. But you don't have to, you can just do it in a plain yellow if you prefer. But it's nice to have a sort of warmth I think and that one these aren't windows these are I think these are all life belts yeah pretty sure okay so the other yellow that we were using was the light chrome yellow and that's the one we're going to finish it off with as we did yesterday just going over what we did and colouring basically over all of the paper in the in the window. If you haven't done yesterday's you can go and catch up after. You don't need to have done it to, the, to do this one. That makes sense, they don't. There's no sort of order, I suppose. Right, now where? Well we've got our flags and I want to do those in the sort of rainbow. So I think if I start with the red, I'm going to just give it a sharpen. This is the deep scarlet red. Hang on, let's show you it. And I'm going to do my first flag in this colour here. And we'll probably need to do another one. So go red, orange, yellow, green, blue, violet, indigo, and then red again here. Let's hope I counted that right. <laughs> and I'm going to do my life rings um, in red and white. I think that's the right colour. Sometimes they're orange, aren't they? But I like them in red and white. The ones around our way are orange. We have some by our um, canal in a couple of places um, where there are houses. But I, they're orange. It probably show it better than red and white, but I don't know why I think they're red and white. I think some of them are. Yes, fortunately, I've never heard of anyone needing to use them. Touch wood, as they say. Right, this one isn't, this is obviously around, well, I say obviously, this is, I think, the window frame rather than a thing. It wouldn't be up there, so we we'll not worry about that one. Now we'll move on to our orange, which is our dark cadmium orange. He's been sharpened away. And this one here... And this one here, I'm going to just sharpen that so it's a little bit blunt and think about where to put some orange. I think it may be, um, hmm, I'm wondering about the main part of some of the buildings. quite like the idea of doing this building in orange. That's what I'm going to do. It's going to be quite a lot of orange, but we had very little on the last boat, so why not? So we just do this building and we've got the little side buildings and the top. Can we do them all the same? I think so. We do the sort of main building render painted in orange. 
Let's hope everyone's doing well. Um, I do hope so. We're in that sort of time of year when people are sort of wishing for sunshine and getting sneezles and <laughs> things like that. So I hope everyone's okay. Um, it's actually raining today, but it's so fresh. It's not too cold. Well, it's not raining now, actually. It's starting to brighten up. But it's uh, it's not too cold, but it it's cooler outside. And I had to go outside first thing this morning to do a few different chores. Um, recycling and um, reading the gas meter is all very exciting. <laughs> um, and uh, we... Um, uh, it was just a lovely crisp to the air even though it was raining it was lovely but I'll be going out a bit later but uh, I can't go out for a bit I'm expecting a delivery so I need for my son to come back from uni before I leave so that he can be here for the delivery and I quite like this bit here and this bit here where they overlap to have a little bit of darker colour in can't really do that with this some um, orange so I'm going to just grab one of these bra handy browns the burnt umber is here I'm just going to put a little bit down here, a little bit of shadow, maybe that's a bit too much, and a bit in there, that one's better, I don't know why that one looks messy, never mind, okay, now we go, I'm not going to do yellow, oh I need to do yellow flags, so this is our light chrome yellow, oh sorry there you go, and we'll do the flags, now it's I'm going to do a few layers so it stands out because, especially this little teeny one, I'm not sure because we've got a lot of yellow here. I may not do any more yellow. I'll leave that aside for now and move on to the permanent green. Yes, yeah, so when my son comes in, he can um, listen out for the postman. I got a very useful email from Royal Mail going, your, your parcel's going to be delivered today sometime before half past seven in the evening. Okay. <laughs> I could probably have told you that. <laughs> now, green. Mm. I'm thinking, should I do a green roof? But then how are we going to bring in our blues and things? Maybe I will. Maybe I'm going to do this bit. Just these lines. I just really haven't done those two. I think they should be an orange. Oh, excuse me, sniffing. Nose wants to run. Of course it does, because, you know, it doesn't run at all when I'm not recording a video. And this roof. I might do a bit more red as well. I have a think. I can always go back to a colour. I'm not restricting myself. Now you see we've got blue, and I'm like, why am I going to put this blue? This is the cobalt blue greenish. Obviously our flag. I'm wondering about the bottom of the boat. Does it go with the orange? Not so well as the purple. So I'm going to go down here with my blue. And uh, just layer it down here. Yes, yeah, so my past is my new shoes, which I'm very excited about. But I've got to go into town and pick up my son's prescription. I went to the docs about his nosebleed and she prescribed some ointment. And uh, I phoned, went into the chemist straight after and it hadn't appeared, which is fine. Went yesterday, a Saturday, and it still wasn't there. So I phoned them up this morning. She said, oh, it hadn't been sent. I was like, oh, okay. Now I just said, oh well, you know, happened. And she went, oh, thank you for being so understanding. Well, <laughs> we all make mistakes, don't we? There's no point in getting cross about it. And it's not urgent, because although his nosebleed's been horrible, he's always had them, so it's not like it's something... Yeah. Anyway, um, I can hopefully pick it up later. Right, there is the blue. Now with the... Um, I'm going to use the violet for the next level. Oh, we're so squiffy. I'm sorry. I now haven't done the roofs. Oh, I haven't done the flag either. There we go. I think 
my heating just came on. It's feeling a bit chilly, but not too much. It's um, my heating set though, so that if um, if the house is warm, it doesn't come on. So it just um, there's a temperature thermostat setting, so it just gets the house up to a particular temperature. Indigo, dark indigo, we need to show our flag. Thankfully I counted them correctly. <laughs> now I'm going to do the roofs with this, I decided. I know um, we've got a few other bits and pieces to do as well. I am going to do, I might do that little fence in brown, just so that we have a bit of brown, because the other picture's got brown in. I think it might look a bit strange if we've got no brown. Um, we Well, we've got a bit of there, but I don't think that really counts. Um, but the other picture's also got black in, which we don't have. I don't know whether I should feel we've got to use them or not. Mm. Have a little think about that as I colour. I haven't got a lot of red going on here. So I was thinking I might like to do red chimneys. Make that darker there. Mm. Yeah, I'm definitely going to do some red chimneys. That's going to be my next bit. So I'll, um, the deep scarlet red for the chimneys. And these little dots like we did on the other one. Mm, try and decide whether to do a red window frame and door or not. Mm. Have we done all the colours? Yeah, we've got a fence, a door. I'm going to do the fence in a brown. I'm going to do the brown ochre for our fence to start with. And that and then the mast, and then once I've done those it will help me decide on the other colours. Sometimes it's good to sort of do what you know you want to do and then you can look and see whether it looks balanced. And I'm going to use the Van Dyke Brown. Whoops. Whoop. <laughs> For the mast. And then the black, whoops, the black for around the window, because I decided that I can't not use the black, I've used all the other colours. Quite close to the indigo anyway, isn't it really? The indigo is very dark. I'm just going to grab my orange and go around that window a bit, where I've missed. We go and then the door just having a think green we haven't got much green let's go with our permanent green for the door now would you have used these colors in this way I wonder what would you have done there so we haven't really got a rainbow apart from in our flags I think okay there we go um but um we didn't really last time apart from on the boat, so sort of have a, bit of a hint of a rainbow and then something else. Our next boat we can put a rainbow in. Mm, fun. I enjoyed that. So I'm going to keep to those same colours for the whole page, I think. Um, will be a bit different, won't it, for us? A little bit, yeah, bright and jolly. But thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a super day and happy colouring. <laughs>